I want to thank you for giving me an opportunity to attend the annual Saving Tiny Hearts Gala. It's a program that is designed to generate some meaningful dollars to make a difference in the lives of those in need. Being that heart defects are the number one birth defect in the United States, it's important for us to find a cure and support the surgeons and the people who are in a place to make a difference. I commend you for bringing the awareness and funding to this life-threatening issue that I have personally been affected by. My granddaughter Susan was diagnosed with a heart condition before she was born. Doctors thought that at birth they would have to perform a surgical procedure. She was born on Valentine's Day 2004 and was diagnosed with tetra tetralogy de follow, a heart defect. Two months later, on April the 15th, 2004, uh, she had her surgery at Children's Memorial Hospital, and I want to commend and applaud the efforts of the doctors, the nurses who treated her. I am so proud and honored to be a part of the Saving Tiny Heart Society. This past year has been for my family and myself an amazing ride promoting this incredible organization. Francie, Brian, it seems like yesterday you started saving Tiny Heart. And now look around you and see how many people love you and support you. Now, Alain has written a book called American Classics, Casual and Elegant Desserts, um, and it's available online. Yes, at chefrobby.com. Yes. And also some of the proceeds of this book uh, goes to Saving Tiny Heart. It's... Um, a group of people that get together, they have children with conditional heart uh, disease, and all the proceeds of the book goes oh, to the research wonderful. and help them. That's wonderful. So. That's Thank you. Nice. This transpired because my agent uh, got in contact, Mr. Christian over there, and his wonderful family, and uh, asked me to come to this event and speak. And it's not about me. I just happen to be a Major League Baseball player. It's more about my daughter. She had to have open heart surgery at four months old. Hi guys, my name is Paul Cardall. I am a musician and a writer, uh, but more important, I am a husband and a father. But I was born 37 years ago with only half a heart, basically just a single ventricle. Uh, I'm just one of two million Americans born with congenital heart disease. And there have been so many wonderful people that have contributed to help keep people like me alive but one of my favorites is Saving Tiny Hearts. They're a fantastic organization that is blessing a lot of lives. So I encourage you to do what you can to help them achieve their goals. Never in our worst nightmares could we have ever imagined having a baby with something so severe. Everybody we know has healthy babies, and yet out of our heartbreak there's hope, and we just, God willing, Joshua will be a grandpa one day, and one day there'll be grandparent survivors with congenital heart defects that will be able to tell their grandchildren that your love and compassion and kindness helped to save their life. These kinds of exciting projects that the doctors are passionate about, they want to treat a lesion, they have an idea, and they need that help getting started. And the Saving Tiny Heart Society has been very, very, very devoted to making those funds available for young, excited researchers.
we're looking at ways of using the patient's own stem cells or other cells in their body to help make or engineer various structures of the heart. Our ultimate goal is to try to make a complete heart in the laboratory. We're hoping that a lot of these advancements that we do in the laboratory will change the outcomes and improve their chances of living What up Highland Park? I'm Tommy T, this is my Spin Master B. What's going on girl, are we ready for this? Yo Highland Park, for your annual fundraiser. Consider saving tiny hearts and this guy in a blazer. My name is Tommy, this is my baby girl, her name is Barbara, and, and she's new to the world. A defect in her heart, the doctors did find. At just three days old, it was surgery time. My baby is a fighter, she's strong and she's tough. After two weeks in the hospital, she said that is enough. Baby Babs came home with a healthy heart and soul. At just three months old, she said, this is how I roll. We went on to Ellen to share our story, cause I'm her warm up guy. Yeah, I opened for Dory. After the show, many charities reached out. We pick Saving Tiny Hearts, cause we love what they're about. To Saving Tiny Hearts, I'll be your MC for the day. After we raise lots of money, we'll watch the Hawks go all the way. Say goodbye, baby Barbara. It's time to go. Peace out, Highland Park. We'll see you soon. Faux show. Wow.